68 years ago our nation builders shared a vision a vision of a country with justice liberty equality and fraternity for every citizen since then india has come a long way however we still have many miles to go when you talk about development we often equate it to improvements in standards of living as an economist one can talk about growth rates we can talk about increases in per capita income and so on and so forth but unfortunately what we find in the field of development is that economic expansion or rising incomes are not necessarily indicators of greater freedom the 20th century had a lot of economic development and growth and has led to the creation of wealth but at the same time it has also led to a lot of inequity a lot of conflict in the world that we live in the citizen of the country uh, gets equal opportunities so there's equity of opportunities there is um, justice so to speak uh, put in place for every last person so there is a lack of supply of talent that can power social ventures social organizations development focused organizations we have often thought perhaps wrongly that you don't need any training for it that if your heart's in the right place you will automatically go in there and you will be able to work passion alone cannot build organizations which will scale or which will sustain which will make an impact is the idea that if we want this sector to scale we want it to be impactful the number one issue is talent that we're going to be faced with and i hope that isdm can play a, a seminal role in helping solve that problem at isdm we have spent a lot of time trying to understand this whole space of development management first of all we realized in the country there has been almost no work that's been done on what we define as development management which means a dedicated piece of work to understand what it takes to lead and manage organizations in the development sector so to be able to look to the future and to build a kind of society that we all dream of there is a need for leadership and management that will track that path or maybe build that path create that path design that path ISDM is really an institution that is hopefully plugging that gap because it's created this really great pro set of programs that take fresh people that take mid career people and really provide them with a very structured stepping stone by which they can enter the development sector At one point in time the IITs came and the IITs made engineering a hugely aspirational career so there are so many institutions that have proven that institutions can make a domain aspirational and build that domain into becoming really effective and i think isdm has a huge role to play and in this case because we are at the forefront of you know starting something like this we have an even bigger role to play and therefore you need not just an indian school of development management but you need actually a network or a whole ecosystem of development management all other institutions but they don't tend to be consistent high quality scalable uh, and one that clearly stands for one thing which is around development management and i think that was uh, the need and and that is what is embodied in isdm